Hi everyone, I'm Jamie Whitaker, the principal of Calf Pen Meadows School. We are so excited to see you again. And for our new students, we can't wait to meet you. This summer, we've been busy working hard to get our schools ready. So let's take a look at some of the things that you'll see when you return. Many of us start the day with a ride on the school bus. When your bus arrives at your stop, the bus driver will welcome you each day. And this year, we're trying something new, bus monitors. Together, these grown-ups will help you get on the bus safely, will make sure you are wearing your mask, and will direct you to your seat. It's a great way to start your day. When you get to school, one of the first things you'll see is the greeter station, just like this one. This is where your school greeter welcomes people as they enter the building and helps them get to where they need to go. Another area you'll see is the main office. The principal and the school secretary work in the main office and it can be a busy place. The important thing to remember is that the main office and the people in it are always there to help you. It's a nice place to visit. When you visit the restrooms, you'll notice a few new things. There will be a notice on some of the sinks saying, do not use. And some of the stalls may also have signs that say, do not use. Of course, the soap dispenser and the hand towel dispenser is still there, along with some reminders about washing your hands properly. Let's all do our part to keep everyone safe and healthy. So now let's take a look at where you'll be spending a lot of your time in your classroom. This year, things will look a little different in your school. First of all, your classroom furniture will be spread out and you'll now have a desk of your own to sit at during the day. Your classroom will still be warm and inviting with lots of colorful bulletin boards and other decorations to make you feel right at home. Here's a cool addition to your school this year, water bottle fillers. Rather than the regular water fountains you may remember, these new high-tech bottle fillers are great. Just place your water bottle under the nozzle and a sensor will turn it on automatically. No touching or turning of knobs required. When we return to school, we will all need to do our part in keeping our friends, our families, and ourselves safe and healthy. So here are some of the things that we'll be doing. When we return to school this fall, everyone needs to wear a mask. All students, all teachers, and all staff. You will wear your mask in your classroom, but you will also have small periods of time when you will be able to take off your mask for a mask break. Your teacher will tell you more about this when school opens. With lots of people in your building at the same time, we need to protect ourselves from germs and other things that can make us sick. One of the best ways to do this is something very simple. Wash your hands. You will be asked to wash your hands many times throughout the day. Turn on the water, wet your hands, apply a good amount of soap and lather up, and then focus on washing your hands for about 20 seconds, about the time it takes to sing happy birthday twice. Focus on washing the front of your hands, the back, in between the fingers, around the nails, and so on. And then rinse everything off. Use something to wipe your hands after that, preferably something disposable like a paper towel. And then use that to turn off the tap as well. If you get a chance, use that to also open the door to the bathroom as you're leaving. If you are not able to wash your hands at a sink, there are plenty of hand sanitizers placed throughout the school for you to use. One squirt, then rub your hands together until it has dried. So easy. This year, you'll see we have installed special arrows on the floor to help keep the traffic in our hallways moving smoothly each day. Some hallways are divided down the middle for two-way traffic. Some hallways will only be one way. All you'll need to do is take a look at the floor to make sure you're going the right way. And you'll see lots of dots on the floors too. 
The dots are a reminder for you to stay apart from others when you're walking from one place to another in our schools. If you stand on a dot, and your friends do too, you'll be doing your part to stay safe and healthy. When you return to school, you will receive your own supply kit containing crayons, pencils, glue sticks, and all the other things you will need to do your work in your classroom. Because we want to keep everyone healthy, you cannot share the items in your kit when you are in school. When you need replacement items, just let your teacher know what you need. When you return, we want to make sure your days go smoothly and that you're doing well. One of the ways we will do this is through morning meetings. We will use this time to check in with you, find out how you're doing, and offer help to you if you need it. Remember, we're all in this together and we're here for you. I hope you found this video helpful as we all get ready for school to start. Wilhelmina and I can't wait to see you. Go Calf Pen!